Hey guys, welcome to my outdoor adventure channel. Thanks for tuning in today. Okay, I've got another product tutorial video here for you. Um, something new that I picked up recently. And I think that uh, all of you guys would be uh, interested in. Um, all you outdoor folks. Um, but before I do that, um, if you like this video and you like the kind of content that you're seeing here, uh, please feel free to like the video and then just head on over to the bell notifications button and hit the heck out of that thing, okay? That way you'll get all of my uh, video uploads on my channel whenever I upload a video, okay? Sweet. Okay, so now back to the tutorial. All right, so what we have here today is a Coleman Sundome 4 tent, all right? And it is a 9 by 7 floor plan and the center height of 4 foot 11 inches. It's a great, great size uh, for backpacking and canoeing. Um, and that's a great center height um, for a tent. You know, when you get smaller tents like this, um, it can get really difficult to try and change uh, clothes, you know, inside the tent uh, because you can't really stand up. But I'm 5'10 and I've been inside this tent and the only thing I'm really bending is my uh, neck, uh, leaning my head over. So other than that, uh, you know, it's, uh, you can stand up by uh, like 85%, 90%, so, and that's great, so. Okay, guys, so what does this tent look like in real life? All right, well, I'm about to show you. Ding, 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 ding. <laughs> look at all that green, <laughs> right? Wow, green. Green, green, green. A lot of green. Uh, as far as I know, folks, the uh, tent is only offered in green. The Sun Dome 4 from Coleman is only offered in green. I uh, didn't see any other colors offered. Uh, and it's an all right green. You know, it's not, uh, it's not you know, pukey green or anything, I don't think, uh, by no means. So, uh, so it'll obviously do. So, um, Okay, so uh, let's talk about the floor here just briefly. Like I said, this is a nine by seven floor plan. Four person, obviously, Sun Dome four, right? And i just quickly show you inside here. Um, it's got that really nice uh, tarp uh, for a floor, okay? Now, uh, all you campers out there, uh, you probably well know that uh, when you buy a tent these days, a lot of times the floor material will be made out of the same stuff that this is. And what they'll oftentimes do is just kind of like rubberize it a little bit more uh, when they use it for the floor. Uh, and then that stuff doesn't really uh, last that long. So I was very happy to see when I ordered this that uh, it had the uh, heavy duty tarp. And this is a heavy duty tarp. Uh, for a floor so uh, there shouldn't be any leaking problems with that whatsoever so um, there is one issue that I was kind of uh, thrown off a little bit by um, when I was uh, constructing the tent and that is these poles here um, these poles you know oftentimes folks as you guys probably well know uh, when you get tents and you go to set them up and everything these poles here are oftentimes thicker right than uh, say the vestibule pole uh, up there. But in this case with the Sun Dome 4, they're all the same size. So I expected thicker uh, fiberglass poles for the uh, construction purposes, but uh, it's just the same uh, diameter uh, as uh, this tarp one. So I was a little surprised about that. And then one other thing quickly about the construction is one thing I love a lot is that there is one uh, continuous sleeve for the two poles that come with the tent for construction. There's one continuous sleeve. So uh, as you guys probably well know again, um, oftentimes when you get a tent um, and you're trying to put the poles through, uh, you have to work your way to the center once you get the pole work through this part to try and find the other sleeve uh, and then uh, you know feed it through that. But in this case, with the Sun Dome 4 from Coleman, it's one continuous sleeve for each of the two poles. That is really nice, it's very handy, so. Okay, so, give you a better look here again. Sun Dome 4. Okay, this tent has two large windows, one on the front here and one in back, all right? And then these walls, are have large screens on uh, on both sides so there's uh, a lot of uh, opportunity for air to come flowing through here and then one other cool feature 
is that. That's a floor vent, okay? And you can use guy lines in the back of the tent. We'll get there in just a minute. And you can pull that out and uh, just have a nice breeze on the floor, obviously, where you're sleeping. So uh, that works out really great. So zip this up really quick. You've got your standard loop in the top of the tent there to hang a light. You know, that's pretty standard. And you got two pockets in there, too. So two nice, cool pockets. So... <sighs> Okay, just working ourselves around here. This is a great product. This is, I'm gonna start using this tent for my uh, outdoor adventures. And I go out on a lot of adventures, <laughs> as you guys know, that uh, subscribe to my channel. But I'm gonna start using this uh, this particular tent, so. Okay, so we'll just kind of get close to the uh, <laughs> vent here. So you can use this here and just stake it out. And you've got a nice little vent in there. Um, you know, like I said earlier, uh, down next to your bed, so get some nice fresh air in there. That'll be nice. <laughs> the tent feels really sturdy. I really do believe that this tent, uh, you know, when properly staked out and everything, and using the guy lines like it did there for the tarp, that it would stay, sustain at least 35, 40 mile an hour winds. Um, it's obviously a three season tent. Um, and you wouldn't want to use this in winter, for uh, example. Uh, but, you know, tough little tent. Coleman's a great company. Um, they are out of Wichita. Uh, this tent, however, is made in China. Uh, don't ask me how that happens. But uh, uh, the Coleman company is out of Wichita, Kansas, and the tent is actually made in China. So that's kind of sucks. It'd be cool if it was made here in the USA. Good old US of A. So... Yeah, so what do you guys think? Let me know in the comments. Um, have you had one of these before? Um, and then do you happen to know if it only comes in green? So just tell me what you know about this tent, what your experiences are with it, if you've had any, any issues with it, okay? All right, so that is the Coleman Sundome 4 green uh, tent. And got it $79 on Amazon. And in my view, it's worth every penny at that price, every penny. And what's really cool too is Coleman gives you this little floor mat here. You know, there's little stakes there uh, that you can use just for when you go in your tent. You know, and now you put your boots there. That is just a really cool feature. I like that. So kind of shows that Coleman's thinking about the camper. So, okay, folks, uh, once again, uh, if you like this video, uh, like the video. And then uh, I'd like for you to uh, become subscribers. Um, and one way you can do that is to head on over to the uh, uh, bell notification uh, button too and uh, just go ahead and uh, hit the alert for all the video uploads that I create so and hit the subscribe button okay that's the best way <laughs> so at any rate folks thanks for tuning in to another outdoor adventure video here another product tutorial of the Coleman Sundome 4 green adventure tent so thanks for tuning in folks